hello friends welcome to my youtube channel today we are going to test the harness of purified water as well as the raw water we have the harness test kit here you can see the all reagent used for the testing of harness that is the th1s th2 th3 and th4 so let's start the testing of harness of purified water first of all we are taking the 25 ml of purified water in a test tube now we are going to add the th1s reagent in the here you can see the reagent th1s we are adding the one spoon of this reagent this tiny spoon is comes with this kit after adding the one spoon of this reagent we have to shake the sample after shaking the sample it is completely dissolved and there is no color seen in the purified water now we are going to add the second reagent that is the th2 the th2 is in liquid form and we have to add it drop wise here it is recommended to add the 10 to 12 drops of this reagent in the sample after addition of 10 to 12 drops of this reagent the color going to change from the clear to blue color so that means there is no hardness in the water if the color change to pink that means there is a hardness in water so let's start to demonstrate the hardness in the raw water so we have take the another sample of raw water here we have add 25 ml of raw water in the test tube and the same procedure is followed as we have done in the purified water so again we have add the one teaspoon of this reagent th1s after addition of reagent shake the sample to get it dissolved now we are going to add the next reagent th2 add the 10 to 12 drops of this reagent if the hardness present in this water the color change from the clear to pink after addition of 10 to 12 drops shake it to mix well so we can get the clear color here you can see the color change to pink color to estimation of this hardness we are taking the next reagent th3 one drop of this reagent is equal to the 2 ppm of calcium carbonate as a hardness so we are counting the drops added in the sample so after addition of 10 to 15 drops shake the sample to get it mix here you can see the slightly change in the color now we are adding the more drops because the hardness of uh, this water is seems to be more so after addition of 15 to 20 drops we can see the change in color the color change from the pink to blue to estimate the quantity of uh, hardness in ppm we have to multiply the number of drops with the 2 ppm so we can get, get the quantity of hardness in the raw water or purified water thank you please subscribe my channel